try to uh, get a little bit more going. Woo! McAwesomeness, thanks for the tutor. Gotta go to work, hope you can finish off those pockets. McAwesomeness, thanks for the cheer there. We are at 599% of what I was hoping for in bits today. Man, you guys are awesome. You guys are just amazing. Love you guys. Love you guys. You guys are good. You guys are great. Yes! Die, Belgians! Fucking South Southern Dutch. Unless you're Belgian, then I love you too. Alrighty. Everywhere else on the line looks good. It's just this this one section right here they've really they're trying to drive a wedge into. Uh, and it's problematic! Well, you guys should be withdrawing. So fall back out of that province. All you guys fall back. Oh, damn. It's Romanians. As if, if the problem was is there were too much concentration of forces. If we draw them out a little more, we'll be, uh, be a little bit better, I think. We can always counterattack from the sides as well once we get a little bit more strength in us. Fucking mechanized ass. Mechan ass. Woo, Froz, thanks for the cheer. Let's make that 600%. 601. You messed it up. It's 601. Now we have to re we have to even it out to 700. Even that right out. Ooh, what do we got? What do we got? Create the Panzer Lair Division. Oh, those are tigers. If I rem if my memory serves. Whoa. Uh, Panzer Lair. Uh, no, it's not Panzers. It's just it's just regular doodles. But I mean, they're kind of they're kind of at the bottom of the list of things to do right now. I'll let everything else finish first. I don't know if you guys can hear my dog borking right now. Bork, 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 bork. That's a lot of borks. Hey, we uh, we fought against the Dutch for our own country. Please don't ins insult us being Dutch. <laughs> Bullshit, I was too generous. Yes, you were, Frog. I have, I have more Dutch viewers than Belgian viewers, so I tend to pander a little bit more. I think you I think you guys can hear the Borkin. Woo woo! 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 Yep, that was Penny. My, my wife's playing with her right now, so they're having fun. Uh, we are making some progress up here, too. I mean, this thing's going a lot slower. It's, it's crossing rivers, it's thick forests, it's swamps, so it's gonna go slower. What do you have that makes it for your game? Is it crashing? I don't know. Um, years ago, when I first started playing this game on YouTube, uh, crashed constantly. Crashed all the time. Now, crashes like every 10 hours or so. Uh, the only thing I can recommend is make sure you have the podcast modified executable file that you can get off the, um, the Paradox forums. That helps a lot. Also what Oddball said. I threw a virgin into a volcano. That helped the situation too. How are we doing here? Ugh, rough. Um, man, they are really, really hitting me here. But it looks like they're about through. And they're trying to prevent a breakthrough here as well. They've, they've moved a lot of troops to the south. A lot of troops. Lala, thanks for the cheer there. Appreciate that. Cheer dance. Bit dance. It's, it usually takes these guys pretty uh, a pretty long time to run, uh, run out of supplies, so I'm not shocked just yet. I'm bummed about having to make tactical withdrawals, but we're also almost on the outskirts of Gorky, and we got reinforcements coming Do you remember a time in. when women couldn't vote and certain folk weren't allowed on golf courses? Petridge Farm remembers. <laughs> um, whoever just asked, do I have Moscow yet? Right there. Right there. I also, take a drink. Alrighty. Man, these guys are beat. These guys are as beat as the red-headed stepchild of a rented mule. Alright, they're counterattacking up here and slowing things down. But again, we're, we're, we're closing the pocket. We are closing the pocket. Uh, 
right there. Bam. Attack! Oh, yeah. And their constant attacks are real... Oh, we finally won down here. Thank freaking God. Um, hopefully we can get troops in there. They're still trying to break through Soshi, but that's not happening. Yeah, we, we're going to repay them in kind for the My Cop disaster. But I can get a stable Hoi 3 Black Eyes for the price of one measly virgin. <laughs> BRB got a sacrifice to Vulcan real quick. <laughs> oh, man, you guys are funny. We breaking through here? I don't know. I think we'll keep it going for now. Uh, why don't we bring some bombers in? You guys are pretty good. Let's bring some bombers over here on some day uh, some day bombing missions. Still a little worried about over here, but overall, yeah. Uh, you keep retreating. I mean, you shouldn't be you shouldn't just be hanging out here. Oh no, you should be you should not be attacking for certain. Retreat, retreat. Um, I mean, these this, this is a back and forth here. We're okay. After I finish this playthrough, Ben, I don't take a while. What country am I going to play next? That's up to you guys. I'm going to make a poll, and I'm going to let you decide. I'm going to let you guys decide what we play next. You holding out here? Um, I think we should retreat. I think we should retreat there. We're doing well, but I think we should retreat and save our... Uh, the Mutsu's been lost. Save our men. Metal, energy, and rares. Don't need it. We're good. We're good. Um, does anybody remember... What happened? Oh, here he is! This guy. This is who I was wondering about. I was wondering where these, uh, these new, um, heavy tanks went. But I found him. There's a gap in the line in the south southern center. Uh, yeah. I mean, here let's uh, let's move one tank there. It's not that big of a deal right now, but I mean, it could be. Thanks, thanks for pointing that out. It could become a big deal. Is the issue, is the thing there? Switzerland is taking themselves to align themselves to the Axis. Yay! Switzerland finally got their heads out of their asses. Attack! Westward ho! Oh, that's a lot of doodles. Um, all right. Uh, yeah. Uh, in the side. Body blow. Body blow. Okay. Yeah, that's that's pretty good. That's pretty good there. That was a hell of a battle. That was that was this big one over here. 47,000 to 53,000. But that was, that was, those were basically, those were Italians and Marines and mountain troops stuck out in the open. Japan, it gets stuck in Nanjing for a couple of years. Yeah, really. That, that, that's been known to happen. It's been known to happen, guys. So we got any cool techs coming? A lot of good techs are coming. Yes! We got a lot of good techs. How long will, uh, did it take you last time to take uh, Nanjing? Um, it wasn't that bad last time. It wasn't that bad last time. I did okay. I think it was a couple months. Which, you know, which was, you know, in terms of episodes, I think it was like three or four episodes. All right, so they're, they're attacking out from here, which I expected. Which I expected that. So let's move you here. Because you're going, you guys are going there. That's okay. All right, we took this one. I really wanted to surround that mechanized division and destroy it, but it was just too problematic. It's too problematic. It was causing too much of a bulge in the line. All right, we took that place, and if we're lucky, we'll be able to blitz Gorky. But I don't think we'll be able to blitz Gorky. Alrighty, man, you guys are still on the move, or well, you're still battling to move, is what it is. These are really, really, really slow attacks. But as, if, as long as we can make progress, you know, they're moving slow, too. So I can still get them in there. SS Panzers using KV-1s, yeah. Uh, it's, remember, it's just that's just a flavor event. It's, it's just a, That's just a flavor thing. It's not a big deal. Can someone recap the last 12 minutes for me? Um, not much has happened, really. Uh, we've made a little bit of progress down here. 
Um, we made some tactical withdrawals in the, the center north. Um, but we intend to counterattack soon because we have reinforcements coming in. You see there's about four divisions heading south right now, which are about to uh, arrive. So this is where we made our tactical withdrawals. But you can see we withdrew with, uh, with, we withdrew with uh, our legions intact, is what it was. We came through with our men intact. And it looks like we're still doing okay down here. And then the 97th Jaeger Division. Do it. Span an air base. Don't do it. Save our money. Gotta make some sacrifices. Stalingrad. Eh, I'm gonna get Stalingrad. I'm gonna get Stalingrad. It's just... Right now... Um, the way I'm gonna get it is by reducing this pocket. I reduce the pocket. I free up troops to put onto the front to attack towards Stalingrad. Because if... Once I get, like... Because this is basically an entire army. If not more. And, uh, well, let's see. Yeah, it's about a whole army. Um reducing this pocket right now i take an entire army and i throw it into this front right now at full strength it's going to tear it to shreds to shreds you say and the plan is to attack basically in this this direction from here up northwards towards the don river and towards the volga that's the plan and what we need to do is every single time we reduce this pocket Every time we take a step, and every time we reduce it, we free up troops to put into the Stalingrad front. Nice. Nice. And what we're going to do here is start reducing this down. This is just a support attack from this side. Nothing, nothing intense. Nothing intense. Just reduce it down for me. Nice. We're moving up this way. We're actually really close to finishing this off here because we took this province and we have troops here. So that's one attack from each side to close this off. One attack. Well, you know what? This poor bastard. This poor bastard has been sitting on garrison duty for ages. Fuck Stalingrad, take over the oil fields. Ah, well, that's the thing. Um, uh, taking the oil fields doesn't do anything because the AI doesn't need resources. And I, I don't need the oil, and they don't need the oil, so the oil doesn't matter. Stalingrad is worth a lot of victory points, though. Uh, what's the difference between supporting attack and a standard attack? Um, uh, standard attack, um, is a attack plus a movement command, so they will attack then move there. And a supporting attack is not a movement command, and they will come in second. So if you tell uh, guys to attack from multiple directions, and then tell someone to support attack from a, a third direction, the support attack will come in last, which means they can open up that frontage to make the combat more difficult for the enemy, but they won't necessarily be involved. They'll be held back in reserve if you are overreaching your combat wing. It's not less, uh, it's not like they're less, um, capable during the attack. They just kind of come in later. But because, th because we weren't using the full combat width here, they are going to be used here. But they're not going to move when the attack is finished. That's basically it. The bit, I normally use support attacks when, uh, I do not want whoever is there to move. That's basically the gist of it. Right, move forward. So yeah, these re yeah, yeah, that's gonna help a lot. That is going to help a shit ton. A whole bunch of tons. Where are those these guys? Oh, uh, you know what? These are ah, they're heavy tanks. They're closer to the northern pocket, but sending tigers into the forests isn't gonna do me anything. I just started Hoy 3 vanilla, and it's not really explained at all. No, nothing is explained at all. Um, if you have any specific questions, feel free to ask, though. Are you attacking uh, Torkov with the now-depleted infantry division? Is this Torkov? Yes, I am. Um, the tutorial is shit. The tutorial is shit. Oh, um... I made a Heart of Vanilla Hearts of Iron 3 tutorial series on YouTube. Uh, so search for, like, Benjamin Magnus Hearts of Iron 3 tutorial... And I think it should show up. 
Um, I did about six episodes that just kind of goes super in-depth over the UI. Super in-depth. Like, I think that my first one, I think I spent an hour just describing what's on the screen without clicking on anything. I haven't bothered to watch it. That, 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 that would help. That would help the situation. Um... But if you have anything specific, you know, I'm here. Oh, this isn't going well. No, I don't need any more air bases, damn it. I need roads. Roads! Well, I don't know. We have managed to drive some of their tanks back. I could counterattack down here pretty good, too. I don't know. These guys just moved. But we have succeeded here. Oh, this pocket is done for. Done for. Well, look at that one. 7,800 to 64,000 troops. You're done, son! Oh! Oddball found it. Cool. Good job, Oddball. Minutia. I need some minutia explained. I learned it from watching. I learned from watching you, Dad! I learned from watching you! Oh, they're using airborne troops! Oh, you pathetic sons of bitches! Ah, you're all dead now! Ah, ha, 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 ha! Woo! Um... Fuck it. Uh... Yeah, I'm just gonna keep putting him here in Calais. June 3rd. So right now, they're only taking a month to build. A month. You lost a hundred IC. Yep. Well, did you did you see the American bombing fleet? It's crazy. There's like hundreds of them. And and you know it takes me it takes me months to repair my my fleet of planes, and they outnumber me ten to one. Yep. That that that's fine. I retreated. But. You know, overall, progress has been made. Overall, progress has been made. Oh, oh, those poor, those poor troops. Those smirchers. I have no idea what smirch is, but they're fucking dead. All right, we're under attack here. Probably all the, I imagine most of these provinces are under attack. But... All we need to do is hold out because there's not much standing in our way now. Did we? Where did we attack that? Oh, this is the province. I was like, where the fuck did we attack them? Right there. Come on, let's uh, let's surround these bastards. So Einzig 45 confirmed. Hey, Baltic Barbarian. I don't think that's gonna happen. Uh, I haven't been here for about two hours now. How the offensive go? Did he get cut off again? Oh, let me show ya. Look at this. Look at this son of a bitch. <laughs> Using tigers in the forest is stupid. Pans over to tanks in the Caucasus Mountains. Hey, they're in the hills. They're in the foothills. They haven't made it to. Oh, fuck me. No, they're in the mountains. No, never mind. You're right. You're right. You're right. <laughs> You're right. They're in the fucking mountains. All right, nice. Okay, what we're gonna do here is a kerplow and a kaplow. Make sure we can take the, you know, probably need a little bit more help there. Let's see, let's put in two more there. And let's just reduce this some bitch. Ha! Prince of Wales has been sunk. Yeah, I lost a hundred IC. Mr. Killhelm, thanks for the sub, appreciate that. They're mountain tanks. You know this. Yeah, they are mountain tanks. They have little goat's feet. It helps out the mountain situation. Little goat's feet. Uh, you know what? We need we need everybody. I, I, I need more men on this. That's what she said. Let's see. How's that going to... Oh, oh, yeah. There we go. Yeah, maximize that combat width. 
It's like fl it's like flanking someone in Hearts of Iron, uh, Hearts of Iron. Um, you're over your Vassalis. You flank them, they're fucked. All right, move forward, you bastards. You're attached to this army. It's a nice army, 300,000 troops. Can I push the cannon fodder? I mean, Italians in the south? Oh, I am. I'm trying down here. How do you flank an EU4? Oh, um, combat width. Combat width. Um, if, if you have... Uh, if you have more combat width than the enemy, or let's let's say let's say total combat width that you could utilize is 20. 20 regiments wide. If you bring 20 and they bring 16, you are not just doing like four regiments better than them. You're doing exponentially better than them because those guys on the flanks have no one to attack. So what they do is they move forward and hit from the edges. So it's a rolling exponential issue of combat with um out outwitting someone exponentially makes your attacks better that's why that's why any military tech that gives you slovakian first corps no idea where that was it could have been over no i don't think that was over here oh look at all those bombings can't do anything about it either how's this going um well not great but okay. God damn it. This is just like attritional warfare in here. This Britney's turned into World War One. Hoi for Black Ice is just as difficult as Hoi. Ah! <laughs> no. No, it's not. It's still Hoi 4. It's still draw a line win win war. No matter you cannot you cannot mod that out. You can't mod that out. Draw a line, win war, repeat. Woo! Okay, so uh, the strategic withdrawals over here went well. We're doing good over here. Nice! Reinforcements have arrived. I mean, there's been a lot of 10,000 to like one in these, in these battle reports. A lot! Well, they're hitting me pretty hard here. Um, be pretty good here too. Counterattacking. Hoi four is harder because the mechanics of the game make it impossible to use the best parts of Black Ice. No, Hoi four. Hoi four is more frustrating, but it is not harder. It is it, it, in no stretch of the imagination is it harder. It's just more frustrating. All right, I, I gotta can't. This attack's not. These attacks aren't getting me anywhere. I gotta cancel these. I gotta let these guys recoup. We're just not making the progress I need here, and these guys are getting attacked. Um, here, let's take everybody I got here, launch them north, just to slow these guys down, because they're attacking me here. Let's see, combat with 18 on 18, and and I'm better than them, so we should be fine there. Cool. A lot of chat. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to keep up on chat here. Good game for introducing people to World War II strategy. Yes. That, that is true. Hoi4 is good at introducing people to the game. That is 100% true. So I just built this. And I'm pretty sure I took away the person he was supposed to go to. So let's start rebuilding a division here. All right, what do we got here? We got self-propelled artillery. Don't need that. Self-propelled rocket artillery. We'll keep that because they're both good. Uh, we got ha uh, half tracks, motorized infantry, uh, mechanized battalion. That's fine. Assault guns. That's good. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is gonna be a real. So far, this is a really powerful division, but it doesn't have a lot of combat. Uh, or combined arms, because I'm doubled up on artillery and infantry. Uh, but that's still better than ha not sitting around ha not having them do anything. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's seven. So that's this guy right here. Whoop! 
trying to keep up on chat here, guys, but there's a lot of chat going on. Um, any... You don't have, uh, you know what? I am low on... Shit, I didn't even think about that. Oh, Two Dog Knight! Missed the first part of the stream, but I see we're advancing again. Thanks for the cheer, and yes, we are. I'm low. That's a full infantry division right there. Oh, this guy is from over here. We'll come back to the front, sir. This is just, this is seriously just World War One over here. I think we're about to take St. Nazaire. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but we're about to take it. Uh, no, that's me. This is them. Yeah, we're making progress. I don't know, I'm kind of running out of juice. Maybe we should cancel this. Let him recoup. I wouldn't call that a major defeat. I would call that a one-on-one, one-on-one. -on -one, one -on -one. Hello, Ben. Hello, Hayate. Hello. Cancel the V2s. Uh, I really don't want to. Um, keeping them going uh, gets the, um, the practicals up, which is nice. And we're just, I mean, they're really, it's only 12. 12 of 500, it's not that much. Brought a couple of people who want to see the difference between Hoy 3 and 4. Oh, Mordred, Viking Raid, I gotcha. Gotcha. Don't share your secrets of titty streaming with Mordred. Mordred, the secrets of titty streaming. Show your titties. Alrighty, uh, let's see. I think we need to get some some airplanes up in the air again. The American bombing, I've lost about 150 IC to the American bombing missions right now. And I need to try to slow them down at least a little bit. So we need to get some fighters back up in the air. So air intercept. Even if it's just limited, even if it's just limited, we need to try to intercept them again. Because they're, they're, they're coming out, they're incredulous at this point. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Die American pig dog air crews. Oh, sorry, sorry. Bomb the French troops that the French ports that are supplying the Americans. French? Oh, these. Oh no no no! I can't do that. The the uh, um the Amer the uh, American and British air crews would would tear me to shreds. They outnumber me ten to one in the air. Ten to one. Oh God! See this 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 is why. This is why. Ah, ah! Chased him out over the English Channel and got slaughtered. I'm gonna get ripped to. I'm gonna get ripped to pieces out here. Yep. So much for getting my air crews recouped. I just put them out there for a hot second and they got ripped up. Yeah, the American fighters are really good. Let's see their attack the defense modifiers 300%. Attack modifiers, 200%. Stacking penalty's kind of high. Night modifier, stacking penalty. Well, you get a stacking penalty no matter what. Can I build SS Panzer divisions with Miles, Miles tanks? Not right now, I can't. I don't have super heavies yet. V2 bomb the American airports in Britain. I tried that. It does not work. It doesn't work, sadly. Yeah, look at this. This was after like one day of 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 intercepting the Americans. They got they got ripped up real good. I think the American bombing campaign's too strong now, guys. It's too strong. Hey, Rebel KR, thanks for the resub. Appreciate that. But that is a that is a nice little pocket we created right there. That is a good pocket. What is that blue province? That's Luxembourg, and they're my vassal. More and better fighters. Easier said than done. Easier said than done. I mean, there's there's literally no there's absolutely positively no way you can outfight the Americans and the British in, uh, in the air. It's impossible. If you did, you you could only do that if you never fought Russia. If you never fought Russia, it would it would be such an uphill battle to fight, to beat them in the air. 
would be so hard, so difficult. Wow, that is a lot of Soviet troops in here. But, I mean... Well, we might be able to complete this pocket depending on how well we do on the other side of it. But you know what it is? It's a distraction. It's a distraction from the center and from the south. That's what it is. Oh, what happens in Croatia and Serbia? Um, there, those are all... Oh, uh, it looks like some, some rebels popped. No big deal. Just some rebels. Not, not an issue, really. So we're closing this pocket. We're making progress over here. Attacking. Oh, yeah. Doing well in the south. We took this province, which means we can reduce our front lines. Moving some troops forward. This is, this is a lot of combat to manage right now. The Soviets are, you know... The center sta oh yeah, the center has stabilized. Um, you see the lines a lot straighter in the center. Um, there's been a there's been give and take. Um, I took some land, then they took it back, and then I took some land, and then they took it back. So there's been a lot of back and forth. But I just brought in a bunch of reinforcements. Uh, the last of them are arriving right now. Um, I brought I I uh, so I brought in four divisions from over here, which were just guarding a static line to help uh, with this section. Uh, these are some brand new tanks, um, some new SS uh, heavy tanks that are coming in over to help over here. This is still the hottest ish, the hottest area, but again, it's um, it's mostly just give and take. It's it's you take this, I take that, you take this, I take that. I retreat here, you and retreat I'm there. Friend Jesus. <laughs> and I'm his friend Jesus. And I'm his friend It's only me. Yeah, think about that. This has been... This is only May. We, we're barely through spring. Oh, My booze is gone. Uh, and when, once these... Once these, um... Troops in here kind of recoup, then we can... We can launch another counterattack. But we've made progress in the north. We've made progress in the south. We've made progress in the center. Uh, what ended up happening was... The spring mud set in, and they saved my ass. What do you do? Uh, why don't you do what they did in, in Spaceballs and suck out all the air? There's no air in the enemy that can't bomb you. That, that would, that, that, yeah, let's try that. Let's, let's, let's turn the Soviet Union into a vacuum. Man, it's been a long time since I've seen that movie. Long time. Hey, Two Dog Knight. Victory 43. Thanks for the cheer there, Two Dog Knight. Appreciate that. Uh, and as long as I can... You know what? Leave this one out. Let's keep driving them back. Let's keep driving them back. Closer to Stalin... Yeah. Yeah. Outnumbering them with, with just slamming them down here with all my panzers. This is why the South has been doing so well. This is where the tanks are. This is where all the tanks are. All the delightful, delightful Panzer Divisions. Scroll up the queue here, make sure everything's fine. I think we're going to counterattack here just to slow them down. I got a couple fresh divisions in here. Straighten the line out, just take that little nub off the... Off the line there. They're pretty weak there, so... Ooh, nice. We are on the... Well, I have been eyeballing Gorky for ages. This Witcher 3 music? No, this is... Uh, the only music I have playing in this stream is Hearts of Iron 3, Vanilla, and Vicky 2. That's what I got playing. And man, the American bombing campaign has knocked over 100 IC off my production queue. Which is basically all of this. All these planes is what they've knocked off. Am I ready for T-34s? I've been fighting T-34s for five years. Well, a little less than that, but you know what I mean. Oh, we might need to cool this here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 17,000 to 2,600. Jesus Christ. They're starting to counterattack in here, but it's not, it's not going completely their way yet. Came here for Hoi 3, followed for the Vicky 2 soundtrack. Awesome. 
Awesome. Yeah, I'm barely producing anything anymore. It's mostly going into reinforcements and supplies and upgrades and stuff like that. Man, this this southern pocket though, this has gone swimmingly well. And we've got them we've got them in retreat over here as as well, which is great. You know what we're gonna do? Italians, ho! Not you though. And use the Italians effectively, I think. Oh yeah. We're actually making some progress here too. With just two divisions. Let's send two Italian divisions into this as well. Let's really outmaneuver them. Just to get a little bit of extra going. Can you buy custom amounts of bits? Um I think you can buy them in different tiers, I think. Oh, I've never bought bits before. I don't know if you can do custom amounts though. Man, my 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 factories in in Western Europe are are massacred. I held off the American bombing offensive for months, but then eventually. Have you taken double the amount of Panzer divisions from the Russian Ruskies? I'm not sure what you mean. Um, I mean, I've I've slaughtered a lot of Russian tanks. I've created multiple pockets and did massive amount of damage to the Russian offensive, uh, to their offensive capability. That is. Oh, oh, oh! The first Slovak. That's got to be the first Slovakian Corps. Yeah, that's bad. Uh, move back to the front because these guys are missing that modifiers. And we are almost to a good defensive position up here. Almost. We're one province from a good defensive position. Huzzah! We're still, I mean, we're still ripping them up a little bit, but I mean, only so much. Look at these guys. These fuck whoops. They got shredded pretty good. The Americans have so many bobbers. Fuck your reserves. Uh, well, actually, you know what? Um... Oh, you guys are already out. Oh, shit. Good. Ah, yeah, shoot them down. Bastards. It's like, I think I just saw them bombing my ships. They are bombing my ships. Get them the hell out of there. Oh boy. Well, these poor light troops. A little too light for their own good. And are we doing a well down here? I think we are. Yeah, the center is tenuous but holding. The south has been broken wide open. Well, not really, but but you know, we've done well. We've done well. Done very well. This has been a shock. Um, didn't think I'd get this far this episode in this uh, this stream to the north. Did not think I'd do that well. And you guys just need to hold off this attack for a little longer and then launch your own. Or I can get these guys to do it. Probably some weak tanks in there. Mr. PT, thanks for the cheer there. We crossed the dawn at dawn to start the, the dawn of life across the dawn. A lot of dawn. It's for the Brits, Mr. PT. Oh man. It's been a good day, guys. Good day. Here, we need I'm gonna fuck this guy up. I hate I hate those mechanized troops. They are such a pain in the ass. We are gonna fuck up those mechanized troops. Damn you, Max! Russians coming out with Max. Fuck those guys up. Fuck them up. I gotta get to the I gotta get to the uh, convergence of the Volga and the Oka rivers. Uh, still trying to lead the charge to a thousand percent in a five-hour stream. We're at six hundred and thirty-four percent. Lead the charge, Mr. PT. You should not be attacking, which is why you're not attacking. Good. Uh, you could help though. Whip! Let's rip that flank open. They're a little, little disorganized, but gotta drive them back. At least keep them weakened. Don't let them get. Don't give them a chance. Don't give them the chance is the thing. And what we should do here, 
Let's see. Let's take any tanks we have and move them south across the river so we're not ta attacking with tanks. Ooh. There's the 4th uh, Schwer Panzer Division. Oh, this is a messed up unit. 